Told me to wake you up earlier so that you can, you know, get a head start on picking out your outfit. I guess it's the big day of school today. You told me yesterday, so that's why I'm waking you up super early. The sun is not even up yet. And Bloxanne is already dressed. She's just waiting on me to take her to school. I don't know what it is about you kids, but you guys love school. But hey, I'm all here for it, okay? <coughs> What's wrong? I feel sick. My chest hurt and my nose is like runny. Wait, you don't feel no. good. <coughs> What's going on? You were okay when I put you to bed. Why don't you feel I well? I know. Maybe because I haven't worn my jacket. I don't know. Okay, well, I know you weren't okay, okay, but I've always told you not to ride your bike without your sweater your and helmet. what else? Yes, and your helmet. I know. They go hand in hand, though, sweetie. <coughs> Safety for your helmet and a sweater for your body. You do not like to wear clothes for some strange reason. It's so annoying, but man. So wait a second. Today was a big day of school for I you, know, right? It was picture day. I had all my clothes laid out. I know. You've been picking out your outfit for like four days now. You even laid it out on the bed the other day to show me. You can't miss picture day at school. I don't think I can go, Mommy. I really don't feel good. <laughs> like, my eyes are hurting, too. Wow. So you don't want to go to school, then, I huh? mean, I want to go, but I can't. That means I'm going to have to stay home and take care of you, then. We can't send you out into the world like this. We have to make sure you're a thousand percent better. Plus, I don't want you getting any of the other kids sick at school. What <coughs> kind of parent would I be, right? I would get in so much trouble for that. I know, right? Wow, sweetie, I'm so sad you don't feel good. Aww. Me too. Oh, I mean, you're still like the cutest sick person I've ever seen, I promise. Oh, thanks, Mom. You're so funny, Phil. I know I'm not trying to make you laugh, but seriously. Okay, so guess what I'm going to do today for you then? What? I'm going to take care of my little Roxanne. I'm going to go make you some soup. We're gonna do all kinds of stuff today, okay? I'm thinking maybe I can like read you some stories, like bedtime stories, you know, things to make you feel better. That sounds fun. Yep. I know. I know, so we're gonna turn a bad situation into a good situation, okay? Yay. In the meantime, I'm gonna call one of my friends so she can come over and take Block Santa to school so that she doesn't miss out on school because I know she's excited about today as well. I'm just so glad that you did not give whatever it is you have, a cold or anything like that to her. Because then I would have two, two sick girls. And that is just no fun. I know. All right, I'll be back, sweetie, okay? Oh, watch out for your cars and your toys. I almost tripped over them. I'm sorry, Mom. I was up late wow. playing. Oh, so one of my daughters is sick, man. I was not expecting this on this good fine morning. I just threw myself a huge birthday party the other day, but no one came. So I'm a little bit still sad about that, but no time to be sad when you have a sick daughter. Oh yeah, let me call my friend real quick to see if she'll take Block Sand to school. Hello? It's Roxy. Yeah, just trying to see if you can come over and take Block Sand to class, please. I know. Block sand, yep. Oh, I'm sorry, girl. You don't always get our names and stuff confused. Yeah, could you take Block Sand to class? I'll take Roxanne. Well, I actually, I actually have to take care of her. She's sick today, so she's just going to stay at home and have a have a little bit of a sick day with Mommy. Okay, perfect. All right, see you in a few. All right, in the meantime, she's going to come pick up Block Sand. In the meantime, I need to get my daughter out some um, what do sick people like? What do sick kids like? Let me drink my coffee. Well, let me sit down and drink my coffee first because if I don't have my coffee, I am no fun, okay? Wow, okay, so maybe I can make her some, what else? Some, what do sick people, what do sick kids like? 
No ice cream, I'm assuming, right? Even though I love ice cream, it doesn't matter if I'm sick, healthy, or what. I absolutely love ice cream. No ice cream, though. Okay. Hmm. I'm still new with this whole parent thing, so I'm still learning. All right, so I'm going to make my daughter some soup. Oh, cold. I made this coffee so delicious. I want to make her some soup and maybe some chili, huh? All right. Rox Roxanne. Oh, gosh. I always call you your sister's name. Roxanne, honey. Yes. I'm going to make you some soup, okay? Okay, vegetable. All right, so we're going to do some vegetable soup. Got to put it on my counter first. So cut everything up. Okay. Man, I was not expecting her to be sick today. But see, that's what she gets out there riding that bike without anything. She never wears a jacket. That girl is crazy. She's gonna, she's gonna stress me out, man. I tell you. Ooh, the soup smells so delicious. I'm super. Oh, man, it smells good. All right, I'm gonna put some salt and pepper in here. Season it up really, really good. All right. Ooh, this looks so good. She's going to absolutely love this. Oh, no, no work for me today. Sorry, I'm going to have to miss out on a day's work of pay. But hey, my daughter is what matters right now to me. All right, Roxanne, here I come. Dr. Mommy's on her way. <coughs> Yay, I thought you would never come. <coughs> All right, come on, get up. Come on, let's eat some soup. Come on. No, I just want to lay here. I don't want to. Come on, hey, hey, I thought you were sick. If you're sick, how in the world are you jumping on top of your bed? <laughs> hey, come on now. Roxanne, you are a crazy little girl, okay? But come on, eat your soup, okay? Okay, just let me just get a little bit. I don't know if I like it first. Let me yep, see. I'm going to allow you to eat in your room. You know <gasps> I never, ever allow that. But wow. I'll allow it today only because you're sick, okay? Wow! Let me taste this first to make sure. Actually, you know what? Come downstairs. Come on, let's come downstairs. You can make it. I don't want you to get your bed messed up. Come on. I'll meet you down there. Hurry up. Man... Roxanne, hurry up before I eat all of your soup, Roxanne. I'm going to eat all of your soup, and you know you like your soup. No, don't eat it all. I'm coming, I'm coming. I have to put on some socks. My feet are freezing. Okay, Mom, I'm here. I'm ready to eat. How is it? Do you like it? I know you like vegetables. That's why I made a vegetable soup and I seasoned it up and I put extra vegetables in there. That sounds delicious. I know. Wow, Mom. This is so good. It makes me want to run around. Oh my gosh, Mom. I just want to walk around with it and eat it. Oh my gosh. I'm super excited about this soup even though I still don't feel good. Eating good soup. <coughs> Makes me feel a little bit better. I will say that. <coughs> Mom, can I just. Mom, I know I will. I know. You didn't even say anything, but I can tell by the look on your face. I'm gonna sit down, I promise. I just wanna take it and go to like the playroom or something. I'm gonna sit down. Okay, so the soup was delicious? Yes, best soup ever! Well, that's good to know. I want to read books now, Mom. Can we? Yes, I can read you a story. Yep, pick Yay! one out. Yep, pick a story out. Yay! Uh, okay, I think I won. Oh my goodness, look, there's so many to choose from, Mom. I think I want to read one that has like mermaids okay, so and villains and cars and all kinds of stuff. Okay, wow. That sounds intense. I know. It's a story about a princess kind of like me because I'm a princess. Okay, perfect. Yep. All right. Yes, we can go to the room. Yes, we can. Yay. Of course. I love mermaids. I love your bed and I love mermaids. All right, let's go. All right, so before I read you the book, you have to promise to take some medicine. Wait, what? I know you hate medicine, I know, but that is 
My only condition, take your medicine and drink your water. And then guess what? What? I'll read you as many books as you want. Deal? Mm -hmm. That wasn't part of the deal. I know you're feeling better, I know. But still, we want to keep you feeling better, right? But I feel fine. I don't even need it. Ugh. All right. Yep. Bedtime after we take your medicine. Open up here. Open wide, sweetie. Uh, you go. Yep. I'm getting on the bed just like you. Uh, Put the book down for two seconds. You know what? Forget it. Here. Take your medicine. And okay. then I'll give you a piece of candy after to get the taste out of your mouth, okay? Gross, Ma. This is so gross. Give me candy now. Hurry. I know it's gross, but you did so great. Okay. Let's rock. Come on. Yep. I'll read you the book right now. Yay! I feel Perfect. bad. I'm ready right. to go to sleep after this. And then after this. that, off to sleep you go. Thanks, Mom.